Pfizer and its partner firm announced preliminary results that suggest their vaccine was more than 90 percent effective against COVID-19. But the emphasis should be on preliminary, and there is much still not known about how well the treatment works. Choi Won Jung has our top story. The world is one major step closer to the first batches of a coronavirus vaccine. The American pharmaceutical company Pfizer and its German partner company BioNTech announced preliminary results on Monday, suggesting that their COVID-19 vaccine is more than 90 percent effective. In clinical trials that started in July on nearly 44,000 participants, half got the real vaccine and the other half a placebo. Only 94 participants ended up COVID-19 positive. The Pfizer said it will likely apply for emergency use authorization from the U.S. FDA in the third week of November. They project that nearly 50 million doses will be ready in 2020 and 1.3 billion next year. Dr. Ann Waltel at the International Vaccine Institute is optimistic about the vaccine's development going forward. What we learned lately is that the vaccine efficacy estimate, 90 percent, is very, very high, uh, which is great. And actually, um, it's a highly protective vaccine, uh, as I see it. And, and, and it shows also that making a COVID-19 vaccine is possible with a high protection. The Pfizer product is a mRNA vaccine, and the results could encourage other vaccine developers to use the same approach. As South Korea said it views the Pfizer news as positive and is in talks to use a vaccine if it's successful. For Korea, uh, Korea might be one of those receiving the vaccines uh, if the authority decides to market the vaccine in the country. So I would say for the current government, uh, I believe they have to make a decision uh, which vaccine should be licensed or used in Korea. However, there are still concerns about safety when it comes to supply and distribution. The Pfizer vaccine will have to be shipped and stored at extremely cold temperatures, which can be a challenge. Some um, safety signal may be detected afterwards um, because the results we have seen are generated in a well-controlled setting. But when you deploy the vaccine uh, you know, widely in the country, you may see additional safety signal that could come up. When asked about what public should do until the vaccines are fully available, she said it's still important to follow virus prevention guidelines to stop the spread of COVID-19. Choi Won-jung, Arirang News.